Welcome to the Heavy Spoilers Show, I'm your host Definition and Orange is the New Black has just wrapped up its final season on Netflix. The send off is bittersweet and throughout this video I'll be breaking down everything that you need to know about the finale as well as giving my thoughts on it. There will be heavy spoilers here so if you haven't had a chance to watch the seventh season yet then I highly suggest that you turn off now. With that out the way I just want to give a huge thank you for clicking this video. Now let's get into my ending explained breakdown of Orange is the New Black. Orange is the New Black arguably had one of the most complex final seasons of a show ever and throughout there were a lot of ups and downs especially in the show's finale that wrapped up pretty much all of the loose ends and gave closure to our favourite characters. The opening packed a huge punch with us seeing Tiffany being taken out of the prison once and for all in a body bag. Tiffany has been a fan favourite from the start and this iconic image let you know instantly that this finale was going to have several gut punches throughout. One of the major ones comes with Tasty who's unable to clear her name after being framed for murder. Though she is initially suicidal she finds a reason to live after becoming a lecturer in prison and she inspires and drives many to go on and get their diplomas which gives her a purpose to live once more. This hopeful aesthetic is throughout the season and the finale is as much about losing hope as it is finding it once more through discovering a new purpose. Nikki goes on a journey and ends up helping detainees contact their loved ones on the outside to show that they have hope and that there will be more to life one day than simply being locked up. This is also mirrored with Piper and Alex whose relationship struggles due to the fact that Alex is transferred. Piper who managed to get out on an early release finds her newfound freedom difficult to deal with due to the fact she's been institutionalised and season 7 was about her coming to terms with the fact that order often kept her in line and without it she feels unable to truly live the life she wishes to. Alex tells Piper to move on with her life and though it seems like she may the season shows that they have rekindled their relationship when Piper visits her once more to show that she's found hope that after all of this is over the two can be together. This is probably the highlight of the entire show and it cements that these characters no matter how bleak it gets always have an opportunity right around the corner that will give them a reason to live and go on. Even Warden Ward who's fired in the very last episode is still presented with something new that could perhaps change the way she values life and thus season 7 is as much about reform as it is rebirth. Blanca also represents this as she's able to overturn her initial conviction and becomes a free woman after suffering for years at the hands of incarceration. She flies to Mexico to reunite with the love of her life life and it's the perfect happy ending that pretty much feels like she's gone off into the sunset to begin something special. Relationships have always made up the foundation of the show and Monica who's reunited with her mother Cindy shows that we can grow together as one no matter the barriers that are put between us as long as there is love there. Even Carla who perhaps has one of the most devastating turns in the finale still deep down has the hope that out there there's something for her and will be able to go on due to the opportunity that could present itself. To me this summarises the true meaning of the show and pretty much highlights the real subtext to it. Life is all about pushing forward and though it will throw challenges our way, there will always be hope that one day we will overcome them either by ourselves or together with someone else. It's a really touching send off and overall the piece shows that though we may be separated, eventually we will all come together in one form or another to find happiness no matter how dark things ahead look. It's one of the main reasons that I think season 7 truly is a classic and Orange is the New Black goes out on a memorable note that is the perfect example of why it's one of Netflix's most popular programs. At one point this was a flagship show for the platform and it's safe to say that this will be remembered as a great piece of television due to its consistency and overall message. Orange will forever be the new black and even though life is full of tragedy there will always be hope of happiness one day. And that's my summary of the final season of Orange is the New Black. Obviously I'd love to hear your thoughts on the finale and if you agree with me or have a completely different take. Comment below and let me know and if you enjoy this video then please like it and make sure you check out my breakdown of this week's other big television release The Boys from Amazon which will be linked at the end. In it I go over the full season and give my thoughts on where the show could go so it's definitely worth checking out if you want to know more. If you'd like to see more of my thoughts on movies, TV shows and games then you can come chat to me on Twitter at DefinitionYT. It's the best place to talk to me and I'd love to hear your thoughts on the things I discuss so make sure you head over there after this. I also just want to let you know that we're giving away a free copy of Avengers Endgame on Blu-ray to one lucky winner and all you have to do is like this video, make sure that you subscribe to the channel and leave your thoughts on the Orange is the New Black finale in the comment section below. The winner will be announced on August the 10th and the Blu-ray will be shipped out from then to whoever gets the prize so best of luck to everyone who takes part. 
This is a channel for people who are never missing television, so if that's the kind of thing you like, you need to subscribe to Definition. Thanks again for taking the time to watch this. You've been the best, and I'll see you next time. Take care. Peace.